Welcome to Hearts of Iron 4. I'm Aesage and I'm playing as the Most Serene Republic of Venice. So last time I was just getting our industry set up. Still going through with the automobile industry here. And I need to research the Spurs Industry 2 before I can get this heavy industry expansion. So after this, I am going to don't need to get. Go for build for the future, either build for the future or our chemical industry, so we get two synthetic refineries. And then it depends on what else is going to happen. I'm going to uh, renovate the railways to get some extra infrastructure in Trentino, which will allow me to get some extra. Aluminium out of that area. Let's see now. Hmm. That would have had, had more. That yeah, doesn't really matter too much. Though, actually, one thing I do want to do is. Go down here to actually get the intelligence agency. You get this research post for military police, but that's not going to be too useful to me. Unless I want to actually go bother with the military police on the garrison unit. Probably not. Use this power. I'm going to go with the captain of industry because I have a lot of things here I want build up on. A few more of these wouldn't hurt. Would hurt. Well, Austria has and Hungary have reunited to form the unit the Austro-Hungarian Empire yet, but... Oh. question is, what are they going to do? As far as expansion goes, I'm probably going to go into, um... trying to declare war on... Croatia, because... We do have something that requires us to own 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 Kavarner. Remember where it was now. Something in the focus. Where was it? Oh wait, that's quite a bit away. So I'd actually need to go after Lombardia, which We need to go to the war with the Italians. This is going to be interesting. They probably outnumber us. Lost. Yeah, just looking at all this, and we have three useless divisions that we cannot delete. And delete this, this, or this. Oh, this. And delete. Want to change this to the infantry division? Not enough artillery, support equipment, or infantry equipment. So, this, this, this. So, do I just leave it for now? Could delete this, but. Portal at the moment. Albania has submitted to, to Italy, so what's going to happen to us? Might want to actually start putting a couple of um, ports in Veneto. But just to help with that. Mm, coastal defense. 
be all that use to us if we get anything for big what for land forts probably. All right, so I have a bonus to use up, so I'm going to use it on this first industry three because that's extra factory output and increase the amount of production efficiency space. I can get if I do go back and get this, where is it? Always something, there's something here. I Build for the future, I could use that to gain construction technology bonus. Wait for this to finish so I can. So I need to have at least 50. Have at least a bit. What's the opinion? Save. So. Okay. Basically, as look. It's only decaying by about three a month, so well, it won't have decayed by then. Well, England is decolonizing. I'm not sure what difference that actually makes because they're already decolonized. I don't know. Estonia got attacked by Serbia and capitulated. Croatia, Yugoslavia, and well, clean. Hmm. There are protectors of. This is going to be uh, tricky. Oh, and Mexico is just having a civil war states, so they're going to try for any conquest. Well, Italy is now in a faction with Austria Hungary and Croatia. They do not like the look of that. And we do not have enough factories or anything for this. This is going to be a pain. Oh, might as well do that. Alright, so now we've got those factories. I think it's time we just start buffing up the army a bit. Finally buff these to... 18 width division. I want to add um, where's this over recon because it'll buff this, and once I've got sniper teams, it'll buff them as well. This cost me much in the way of infantry equipment or or equipment. It's worth doing. Just take forever to build. Oh, now the anarchists are to war on civil war. Can't do any land lease, can I? Nope. Huh. Union of Central Arabian States joins the commentary. That is, I never thought I'd say. Yeah, Saudi Arabia went communist. The neighbors up to. They're saying monarchist. 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 They're going communist. Iraq. Nope. Kuwait is going communist as well. Kurdistan is saying not aligned. Iran is going flat as 
ist. Hm. Afghanistan is going communist. Pakistan is known. Tunisia is going communist. Algeria is known. Morocco is staying monarchist. Libya is the what you doing. Hmm. Then. Oh. Well, I've got other things to worry about on my doorstep. With this, I'm um, organizing the armed forces. I'm going to try and go down here, get these, then double back and get expand naval bases. So we gain some extra and an extra duck. Then go down here to reorganize the arsenals because we need military. Hmm, Turkey's declared war on Syria. We take probably Hattie. And if they'll go end up going to war with Kurdistan after. Um, Iran has declared war on Afghanistan. Mix this. It's probably not going to end up too well because the situation is probably not great. Hmm. Afghanistan has a railway from Harash to Kabul. Interesting. And now Iran has just declared war on Iraq as well. What they're They managed to push into Afghanistan a little bit, but their supply situation is going to be awful because they've no, no railways around here. Oh, we're actually pushing in. The Serbian state joins the Rome Protocols. And we can't really do much because we don't have enough, enough world tension. Well, we can now create a collaboration government in Greece. That gets let's get this straight. Venetian Greece, so we have them as a puppet now. It does mean a little bit less um relations regulation, but we're not really using all that much anyway means I also don't need to manage the whole what you call it I don't need to manage that that garrison stuff anymore it's a thing to worry about So I'm going to try and see if I can join the Rome Protocols. I know I'm not on good terms with the Italians, probably the Croatians as well. But we're basically surrounded by potential enemies and I just do not want to deal with that. Oh, the USSR has a civil war going on. Hmm. Really, is just staying out of it. This guy, Lev Kamenev. Zone of the European Pact. So, the commentary is no longer a thing. And there, with the Latvian People's Republic as a pup.
Yep, too far away for me to really do anything about, even if I want to. Slovenia has just been... Serbia has just declared war on Slovenia. Which means all of these lot are going to go to war with them as well, probably. Oh, and they go to war goal against... Bosnia. Asia. That'd be interesting. In the oh, of sense, not because our research is a bit slow. No, oh, Serbia hasn't called their allies in yet. Is okay. They're also born between. Fascism and communism is getting weird. Oh, now they've declared war on Bosnia, so they're going to Bosnia. Are they going to declare war on us afterwards? Apparently not. Well, isn't that an ugly? So they did pull call everyone in. But Slovenia is pretty much gone. Croatia is. Defense for Slovenia. Going on there. Huh. The anarchists managed to take Spain. Oh. That's the Spanish colony. They take. I can't remember who was what. Minor. Well, we can't join their faction yet because they don't like us enough. It's annoying. Well, Iran has finally taken Afghanistan. Of course, now they've still got. They've, still, they've obviously sold here with Iraq. Well, first spy. Let's look at the with the well groomed agent to pressure on the Kingdom of Italy. See if we can persuade them to let us join their faction. Take a while, Bruce. Okay, this is starting to look like I might not be able to do this after all. You can see here that sh that different ideology thing is causing a massive of uh, debuff to our chance of them actually joining in their faction. Would you like for me to go back and do this? I suppose I could just um. Try and race one of these guys with a fascist demagogue. Okay, actually, worth doing it at this point? Probably not. Alright, so this has been a bit of a look at the at the focus tree. 
honest, it's not as exciting as I thought it would be. Being surrounded by a faction that all of which is heavily close to us is not going to be very fun. So I'm going to end this playthrough here, and I'll see you in the next one once I figure out what that's going to be. If you have any suggestions, feel free to put them in the comments below. Otherwise, bye for now.